Hey guys, Luis Moreno here, Simply Health Insurance Agency. Just got an agent question. The question is, how do I position myself to sell a hospital indemnity plan when I'm talking to an insured about health insurance? And we're making the assumption that this person is under 65, so we are selling an ACA policy. All right, but before I answer that, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. So again, here we go. Question is, how does an agent position themselves to sell or recommend a indemnity policy to an ACA client? So here's how you would do it, or at least here's how I do it. So let's go run a quote. So we've ran a quote for this person, and uh, I'm just going to go with this first silver plan. Okay, forget the plan, but this is how I do it. So you're going to see here that the insured has a deductible, has an out-of-pocket maximum of 3000 what I normally do is I tell the insurance, do not focus on the deductible. I will tell them, focus on the out-of-pocket maximum because this deductible is embedded into this out-of-pocket maximum. The out-of-pocket maximum is the most that they will pay throughout that calendar year for medical coverage. Okay. Now, if there's more than one person in the household, this is a per-person out-of-pocket maximum. But with ACA, the beauty of it is only two people in a household need to meet this. So let's say it's mom, dad, and two kids. All this means is that two people out of that household of four will have to meet this maximum out of pocket. Okay, so, but we're talking about a single person just to make it easy here. So we're at $3,000. The way I pivot to an insured in this scenario is I will say, you got $3,000 to pay for this? You got to remember, you're going to hit this if you get hospitalized. There are other server, other medical services that will, will that cost will go towards this, but usually it's going to be a hospitalization. So the question is, you got three grand? Most insurance would say no. If they do say yes, then you pivot to this next question. Well, do you want to use it for this? And most of them will say no. Okay, it may be their emergency fund, their savings, whatever it may be. So I'm like, perfect. Most of my insurance, here's what I provide them. So you can do two things, agents. Number one is I like using Allstate Health Solutions. They bought out National General. It's the same company, just rebranded. What I do is I go to accident. After I ran the quote, you go to accident. And what you will do is you'll filter down here to, well, let me get to the right, accident plans. There we go. So you will filter down here to AME. AME stands for Accident Medical Expense. So we're going to start off with, uh, let's go with $2,500. Now, I can't meet the exact $3,000, but I can meet $2,500 of it, or I can go a step up and go to $5,000. But let's just focus on the $2,500. So for $2,500, with a deductible, depending on year one, year two, or, or after year two, we will reimburse the insured for up to $2,500 for any accident. Okay, there are some exclusions. Read the read the brochure, read the, read the, the fine print. Uh, uh, one of them is they can't be committing a crime and have this accident. Um, but most accidents, it's going to reimburse them up to 2,500 bucks. So if they break an arm, they go to the ER, let's just say that's two grand. Uh, they get treated there, they get a, a cast, Let's say their total bill is $2,100, okay? We're not going to write them a check for $25. they are only going to get up to $2,100, whatever their actual expenses are. Now, I will go a step up. I will ask them. Usually, I'll kind of wait there for them to think, but if they don't pick this up, what I will do is, is I'll ask them, well, I've got your accident, but how else do you get in the hospital? And they'll say, well, I got sick. Perfect. I can add a sickness rider to this. Now, it does take my premium from $13 to $28. So now, if they purchase this combo, if they're in an accident, we will reimburse up to $2,500. If they're admitted into a hospital due to any sickness, we'll just write them a check for the $25. Then what they do is they use this money to help meet their out-of-pocket. Another good scenario is that's just, you know, they're still $400 short or $500 short. Well, you can bump it up to 5,000. 
You can do 6,000. You can do 7,500, 7,900, 8,000. So all you've got is these different numbers. Now, as far as issuing the policy, the accident, just fill out the application and it's guaranteed issue. The sickness will have some underwriting questions, but that's how I pivot. Now, guys, before you leave, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Click down below. I've got some goodies for you. Number one, I've got the ACA course. I've got my agent CRM, my, my marketing machine. If you want information on our Facebook course, I've got it down below. Click down below and you can gather all this information. And up here, I've got more info. In fact, it's going to be on this side. Up here, I'm going to put information on the um, on our uh, Facebook ad course if you're interested in it. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>